Hey everybody, welcome back to my video. In this video, I'm going to be telling you how to convert decimals into fractions. Now, I've got some examples here. For example, 0 0.4 equals to 0 0.65 equals to 0 0.002 equals to. Now, it's quite easy. All you need to do is look at the point. Now, the point... Um, there's four after the zero, so this is four tenths. So the denominator would be ten. And then the four is in the tenths place. So you just put a four like this. It's really easy once you get the hang of it. So you basically need to look, and this is um, in the hundredths place. There's one, two digits in the hundredths place. So you just put a line there and then 100. And then this um, six, six, five in, in the hundredths place. So you just write six, five, like that. It's really easy once you get it. Um, and you basically need to look at what place it is so this is um ones tenths and hundredths and then this is um ones tenths hundredths thousands so then you'd write a thousand like this and then there's a two so you just write a two like this. Now that was pretty easy because all you need to know is your tenths, your so you need to know your ones, your tenths, your hundredths, your thousandths, and so on. Now what I've drawn here is almost like a place value chart to make it be easier. So let's say you do zero point two one like this so as you can see this is the ones these are the tenths hundredths thousands i don't know ten thousand but we don't need that for now and so there's zero ones there are two tenths there's one hundredths so you'd write it down as well there's hundredths so you'd write hundredths um, as the numerator and so you write the denominator as 100 and the numerator as 21 so 21 over 100 now you can also represent it like this 1 add 88 over 100 equals 1 88 over 100 you can just partition it this way or you can do 2 Add 0 0.37 equals 2.37. So now we're doing addition with numbers. And now we just do it normal, like 7 and 6, 13. I carry the 1 on the top. Then 1 add 3, 4, 4 add 4, 8. And then this is the really, really, really important bit. You just drag the, this decimal point down here. Nothing complicated. You're just moving that one space. Then you do 2 add 1, which is 3. Now, it's nothing complicated. It's really, really easy. Like, don't do anything like weird with the numbers. Um, it's not 3.83. It's 3.83 because this is like in decimals. So we... We just don't say it as 3.83, it's 3.83. So what a lot of people do, which is really, really common, is that let's say they're doing 3.25, add 2. Now you wouldn't just write 2 here, because then that'd actually be, that'd actually be 0 0.02, which isn't actually. Um, you're actually doing it by a whole number, which is 2. So what you would do is, you should always remember this, you should always do this. So it's 2, 
point zero zero because two is just a whole number and then there's no like decimal places but you still need to keep the um placeholders to make sure that you didn't do the mistake where you put the two here because then it would be zero point zero two which um wouldn't be correct as this is a whole number and then you just do normal like this um, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you learned how to um, handle decimals properly and how to convert decimals into fractions and fractions into decimals. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe and share. Bye!